advertise what has so far been a phenomenally productive relationship with the Park Police. What has so far been a phenomenally productive relationship with the Park Police. Mike Jack. Mike Jack. public event so I'm gonna keep filming. I do miss hanging out with you. Ashamed to be filmed, or like you don't you don't want there to be a, a public record of, of what's being. Well, I, I'm being an asshole by standing in public and, and recording this public scene. And, 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 You don't think people standing up for a cause in public should be willing to be filmed? Can, can I just point something out to you as a camera operator? This is getting the fucking back. Oh, I'm sorry. Not face. Blood, it's not that complicated. I realize you knew it. There's, there's a little toy ring, but try it out. Just stand the back. So this, this is how Occupy DC regards the media, the independent media. I'm independent media. I film everything we do. I respect what you guys do. Excuse me, I didn't, I didn't hear that last part. What was that? Step over here and I'll talk to you. I don't want to interrupt you. Step over where? Just back up. I'm like talking to you, man. Okay. Yeah, you can film me all you want. I'm independent media myself. Yeah, but, everything we do. but you don't think I should be able to film this public event? When someone asks you to stop filming their face, you should stop. And your you shot looks like photons. shit. You don't own the light photons. You don't own the light photons. That's a really good argument. That's an incredible argument. I would right? say. That your shot looks like shit. You should punch back just a little bit. I'll step back for you. There you go. There is a private meeting where you have third box right the people there. here raise Just move to the back and film. We've got no problem with you filming the process. Matter, just it's just there are people that don't want to be on the camera. 
If they don't want to be on camera, they shouldn't be standing in public. They shouldn't be in a public place. What's your argument for that? They shouldn't be in a public place. But if you're in public, if you're calling for something, you're making public demands, you're asking the government to do something, you should be willing to stand behind that. So that implies... If, if you want media attention, you should be willing to, to stand in front of the media. That implies that you have consent to be filmed merely walking outside. I think, yeah. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Absolutely. So you're saying the moment you walk out your door, you consent to be filmed. Absolutely. Yeah, I, I, yeah. I mean, if people Absolutely. aren't interfering with Are what you you're doing. Texas? They're not in your Are public you space. Texas? You sound like you're from fucking Texas. This isn't Texas. This isn't the South. This, is, this isn't where you get to just do shit because you feel like it, all right? Someone asked Wait, you to not Wait, hold on. Can film. I ask them a question? Absolutely. Why are you filming? Because I think this is interesting. I think it's an important conversation. Okay. I disagree with a lot so of it, but I think okay. this is important. You know so when people, right when people, when people, no, 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 I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll post this. I think I this, I think this conversation is important. I disagree with most of what's being said here, but I think it's an important conversation. So how does shifting around to the back with better light exposure on what you're shooting a bad idea? Explain that to me, please. How is blocking my camera a good idea? Because friends of mine and colleagues have asked to not be filmed, and you have decided to disrespect that. And it's a public place, so under your own argument, I can do what the fuck I want. Correct? Yeah, oh, he's, he's on, I mean, I'm not interfering cool. with anybody's right to move their body. Me. I operate stand, a camera for a living, stand people block me all the time. Yeah, I sure. Do. Sure, you're totally welcome to stand in front of me. And I will. As long as, long as you're really out of, out of my personal space, you're not physically threatening you me. move to the back, I'm gonna sit the fuck down. I won't be part of this meeting. But you, you have a demonstrated a clear lack of respect. I'm not going to say you're Republican, but you probably are close to the only new. Oh, if I'm, if I'm disrespectful, I'm a like Republican? A hard, whatever, dude. It might just be an idiot. No, there's, there's, always, there's always that. Too. No, I think he's just disrespectful and he's trying to provoke You us. know what? I shouldn't have said Republican. I've had a long he's, day. He's, I'm tired. That was so actually really misinformed. I have, I have I a question, another question. Just fucking boots and I, won't, I, I don't take people Republican. out of context. You won't get that, man. Personal tags aren't going to help either. I have another question. So... Let's say, you know, you're in a public meeting and let's say that you're with some friends who have had, you know, bad experiences being filmed before. Somebody's followed them home, somebody who's looking for them, for a woman who's been abused before. And it's a friend of yours. Like, if she asks somebody to stop filming her, do you think she has a right to do that? Well, stalking is something other than covering a public political meeting. Sure. I mean, you're, you're equating that is not really accurate well but there yeah, are people point, within this meeting who've had all kinds of experiences and so if they've had all kinds of experiences and somebody is capturing them on film and possibly leading them yeah. to something dangerous that's, and you that's think a that, good that's a good argument for shutting down the, the, I'm not, the, the I'm not the making first an amendment. argument I'm trying to explain to you that this is a collective process where everybody's trying to feel safe together and maybe you could learn from it if you sat down and listened and listened to the way that they're trying to do consensus method and get everybody to agree on things mm -hmm. and get everybody okay I'm, I'm gonna go back to recording the meeting I, I Oh, so you don't want to listen to me even though I'm consenting? No, I, I, I th you're interesting, but you're not as interesting as, as this meeting here. I think it's really important that non-violence is actually above the law, and non-violent civil disobedience has a very long tradition in D.C., and I think that's something we do in action by talking to each other, getting consensus among sure each other, allowing for autonomous action in such a way that it doesn't disrupt what everyone else wants to do, everyone else's ability to be safe, I participated in direct action that hasn't gone right for a lot of other people, and so I've learned a lot about how to do that kind of thing properly, and I'm really looking forward to having conversations with people about going forward with that. In the meantime, the phrase, obey the law, and simply talking about how we can have this perfect relationship with the police, I don't mind leading to a lot of people, and assume that it limits us. I think it'd be better. There are yeah. better ways to push what we want out of that, which is not the first one of this group. More exciting than, you know, well, I already covered one of the marches out of here. Oh, one of the marches. They've been here for a week, did you know? Every day, I know. All day. Yeah, well, well, you're going to blame me because I haven't covered every single one? Huh? You're going to hold it against me that I haven't covered every single no, no, one? No, I'm just saying you haven't, one is not all. Okay.